It's my fault. <laughs> got running red light. Got me the finger. Bullet. Still don't understand how that works. Mm -hmm. Got everybody in there looking like Superman. Yeah. Somebody couldn't fit. Very observant you was on my toilet picture, wasn't yeah, it? I know. What a jerk. Yeah, I know. He wasn't going to do that because you told me. But don't worry, I'll hold the book like that. <laughs> he thought, uh, you know, he didn't want nobody making money off that. But anyway, anyway okay. okay. All right, guys. Ring full here. Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. Mm -hmm. Kurt Angle's here, too. What the heck, man? Hey, you got to start running these people off, George. <laughs> <laughs> we got too many people in the ring. Okay. Right, here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another edition yes. Dad, you don't work, you wrestle. You hear the claps. You know what time it is? George, how was your weekend? Boy, unbelievable. I appreciate, first of all, right off the bat, you holding the book the proper way that that second greatest book ever written should be held. But everything is going a mile a minute here at Dad, you don't work, you wrestle. Television, highspots.com. The parking lot was full. Yes. As you know, of course, and I, I parked down the street, but that's okay. But we are here, boy. I had a great, great week, as we always do here. Mm -hmm. And just an amazing thing, one of the most amazing things, boy, is, of course, uh, Thursday and Friday, I was in a little town called Rhonda, North Carolina. I'd been all over the world, had never been to Rhonda, North Carolina. Uh, this town was uh, way, you, so far out in the sticks, boy, that it, I, I'm just going to tell you, and, and a true story, they had no cell phone service at all in this town. And you think here at 2014, 2015, whatever it is, that you would have cell phone service, but no, I've been to West Virginia before. I know there's no such <laughs> Boy, it was there. awful, but they drew a good little house, the most amazing building. Of course, the promoter's gonna be mad at me because I'm telling them where this great building is that all these outlaw guys can go run. Mm -hmm. But brand new community center bullet there in Rhonda, I think he got it for like 50 bucks uh, mm -hmm. a night. Uh, I do have a show book coming up, I'm sure but you do. Uh, they got concession. They're just amazing. There's still a building left that nice that they ain't nobody messed up yet. Yeah. But uh, anyway, great, great show there. We did, we were there Thursday and Friday. And had a great, great time there. And of course, uh, you were with PWX that week. Yes, and then we kind of Sunday and share rendezvoused Sunday afternoon in Ziggy's. Yes, we right? did. It went to Salem. Busy, busy, busy week. And I do appreciate, well, I do appreciate you. I brought a guest, first time ever that Dad, you don't work, you wrestle. Had a very special guest there, yes. Bullet. And I'm not saying this because you're my co host, mm -hmm. but you and just so happened to be my other student had the best match, what she said. Now, she's been a big, big fan mm -hmm. her whole life, boy, from, uh, and so she knows what the heck she's talking about. Yeah. Uh, so it was awful nice to meet you. Big, She's a big fan of the TV show, boy. Mm -hmm. Of course, if she wasn't, uh, she wouldn't have got to meet you. But uh, She wouldn't have got this far. She wouldn't have got this far. But she, the, uh, didn't matter what she looked like, well, she said she's a fan of the show. Mm -hmm. There's a second date. But, but anyway, boy, had a great, great time. She enjoyed the show. Uh, I thought y'all worked real, real hard. I was going to say I thought everybody did, but I'm not going to go that far. But anyway, I thought, <laughs> I'm just, I, thought, I thought my guys worked hard, Bullet. Uh, but anyway, great week, Bullet, again. And this week, uh, I'm excited about this coming Friday. Yes. Uh, right here in Charlotte, North Carolina, back at Club Hush. Yes. Right? Yes. Yeah. All women's event. Yes, yes. Right? Wrestling show, uh, Queens of Combat. There'll be five matches. It's gonna be an uh, excellent card. Uh, tickets are still available. Uh, right, right off Independence, uh, just a stone's throw away from the old Coliseum. It sure is. So uh, I had a, uh, several emails this week of people. They uh, even some guy. He didn't go in idiot bag yet, but he said, "I thought y'all were just at Club Hush." And I told him, "Read the fine print." We Remember were that. there. Charlotte is the hottest wrestling town in the country. <laughs> it days. sure is. Right down the road from HighSpots.com. Yes. So anyway, got a got a ring full of people tonight. Uh, they stumbled in here by mistake. We're not sure, but mm -hmm. we're fixing to throw a couple guys around. But before we do, Bullet, a quick idiot bag contestant, if you don't mind. No drum, problem. Uh, drum, drum roll, please. And what's so amazing about people, Bullet, and you know everybody's nuts. Uh, we get a lot of good compliments on the idiot bag this, uh, of just everybody that we throw in there, from major corporations to my lady at McDonald's who screwed up my order. Anybody going idiot bag, but what's so amazing about that little town about Rhonda, North Carolina, everything was going good. I mean, the hot dogs were good. Uh, matches were so-so, but still, I was selling some books. And what's so amazing, boy, as you well, know... The fact that they were so-so probably helped you sell books. Yes, they, yes, they did. And what's so amazing, boy, as you know, several months ago, we had the big dumpster dive, and I got yes. a lot of stuff out of there, and a lot of great, great stuff. And I've got a lot of stuff, a lot of big show t-shirts from WCW and stuff, nice shirts that I've used to give away when someone purchases a few things. So, anyway, it's a free. You know, and, and the word free is what I want to focus on here real quick, Bullet. But this lady came up, bought several things, bought a book. And for the first time in my life, Mr. Number One was feeling nice. So, I just 
told the lady, Vicki, that helps me. I said, give me one of them Big Show t-shirts for her son. So, not thinking, bullet. I gave her the t-shirt, free of course. And of course, that lady looked right at me and she said, this is the only one you got. I said, ma'am, I said, the shirt, I said, it's free. I said, it's a gift, which I don't never do. She said, well, it ain't the right size. <laughs> so that in itself is why I'm never nice to anybody, bullet, okay? So she basically gave me back my free Big Show t-shirt uh, because I didn't have anything for her to choose from and it was the wrong size. Yes. So that lady who I did not do more business with her, uh, I do not know her name, I just know she was an idiot, hmm. okay? And her son was an idiot, okay? So both of them, first time ever. Now, you see now, uh, great co-host, why I'm not nice to anybody, I, but, I, okay? I, I absolutely agree, and, and also, too, that's a situation where, um, I'm trying to think of a better, better, better word for crazy old man disease, or old, old wrestler disease. Yeah. <laughs> the old wrestler disease, where we're, we're having that is, is a, a benefit. Yes. Because if somebody gave us something for free. Oh my gosh. We'd done grab it and we'd run away oh. and we'll figure out what we have in the car. <laughs> so yeah. whether it fits or not, bullet, we're taking it. Ain't but at the same time too, I, I can't say it's crazy old man disease because I'm sure a 14 year old Jake Manning, if he was giving a wrestling t-shirt, would grab it. And even if it was 3X, he'd probably wear it like Scott Hall did when he was the <laughs> Outsiders. I think it's the greatest thing ever. Of course, I'd, so, I'd cut mine and tighten a knot in the front like Tommy Rich does. In front yeah, of uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Same, same thing. But, but uh, so that woman and her son will go in the idiot bag this week. It was a gift from me. Now, everybody that uh, realizes I'll never be nice to you again, you can blame that lady that was in Rhonda, West Virginia, because I didn't have. Because you'll never be nice again. I will never be nice again. So anyway, that that's uh, see, that's been my biggest defense right there about anybody being nice. Is you see how people treat you. So. Mm -hmm. she, she, she basically gave me back my free Big Show t-shirt. So, uh, it, I won't give it out again. So, I'll just sell it to her next time, Bullet. Then you got a right to complain. Exactly. So, thank you so much, Bullet. Just a great, great co-host. Uh, co I'm going to be with you this week, Bullet, again. Yes. Uh, as we uh, hang out at Club Hush. So, yes, thank you, everybody, uh, for buying the book. It's doing so good, Bullet. I was able to present one to uh, Tully Blanchard this week. Uh, I, I hope he liked it mm -hmm. and uh, gave, gave the buck to Tully. Uh, this week was just kind of exciting for me. So a great, great week. Got to hang out with Tully Blanchard for a little bit. I don't know if he stayed for the show or not, um, but he was there in Ziggy's for a short time. So anyway, had a great, great time. Thank you, Bullet. A lot going on here. Getting ready to get in the ring. Throw some people around. So I'll catch my breath. Okay. Okay. Just like just like your special guest said, I, I got to get in where I fit in sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> and, 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 and and before we sign off, this is one of those times. There's a young man by the name of Austin that watches our show on a regular basis. Who's um from uh, actually my hometown area of, oh. around the Preston, Iowa area. Good friends of the family. He he watches all the shows. And when he found out that because uh, he ran into my mother as soon as he found oh, out gosh. that this is a uh, mama bullet, he he all proceeded brother. to tell. Her all about all his favorite wrestlers, and he knows about Ring of Honor, and he's just oh, wow. a young kid, and wow. all these things, and it's just one of the amazing things about the technology that's out there. Because wow. growing up, as you you and I went through magazines was the His thing you had to do. That's exactly I was right. trying to look through the TV guides and the, and the direct TV program guides to find the syndicated shows at 1 a.m. on Saturday. Right. And here, you know, you have all these wonderful things available and somehow he stumbles onto this wow. nice little TV show. So I just want to say hi to Austin. Thank you, and, Austin. And, and, for always, and, and to continue to be a wrestling fan because it's the best time to be a wrestling fan. It sure fan. is. It sure so. is. And I do want to put a quick plug in for our buddy Zane Dawson who this week, Bullet, and I can't really let the cat out of the bag, but he's... He, he's going uh, south. Yes, he is. To do he's something going, important. He's going south to with do an something important very, company. He, he sure is. So, so, oh, I love that, Bullet. Oh, I love that. So he's just... be sneaky. Uh, I love that. So he's very, very excited and nervous. It's a big, big chance. And and we're just... Uh, I, I told but him he's they, investing in himself. Hey, 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 exactly. Exactly. And I love that. He, it was kind of a neat that he's flying down today, and, and we just talked a little bit about, you know, he's never flew before. So kind of exciting jitters and stuff about all this, not only just getting there, but uh, he's just, uh, uh, you know, excited right now, and it's just an exciting time for him. So, like you said, he's investing in himself, and, and we hope good things, uh, we're praying for him, and we hope good things come out of that. So, we'll keep everybody updated. So, thank you, boy. Thank you. But uh, also, another company that's located not quite north, but not quite south, that has something very important. Stuck right in the middle. Exactly. Stuck right in the middle. But we definitely have something important that is available that we can tell the whole world about, and that's the second greatest book of all time, which yeah. is available at highspots.com. But you ain't getting the free t-shirt. No.
<laughs> Very good, Bullet. There. Very, only you could relate to me, Bullet, about that lady. She made me so mad. First.